Hi and welcome to MultiTeach. In this tutorial I will provide an overview of the corner menus in the main interface of MultiTeach and then review the corner menus for the lesson apps. Starting in the main Snowflake interface, you'll see that I've set access to corner menus in each corner of the screen for this demonstration. The default setting is two menus on opposite corners. I can minimize the screen to access an application on my computer or the web. In this case, I'm accessing a YouTube video. Opening up Snowflake, I can select the Annotate icon to draw on the screen. To rotate the screen, I can select the Rotate icon. I can set the screen to appear in zones using the zones icon. In this case, four zones. The zones feature is useful to set up the display for several students. As you can see, the rotation icon is useful when MultiTeach is presented in table mode. The sound, no sound button looks like a note, and by selecting it, I can enable or disable audio. I can exit MultiTeach by selecting the exit icon. The corner menu icons for the various types of lesson apps are similar to the ones found in the main MultiTeach interface. I'll use a scramble lesson as an example. The convert button lets you switch your lesson from one type to another, depending on the type. For example, you can convert a scramble lesson to a guest lesson on the fly. The back button is an arrow, and it takes you back to the previous step in the lesson creation or presentation process. In this case, it takes us back to Scramble. The Hide Reveal button is available in some lesson types to reveal the correct answers with the open eye or hide them with a closed eye. The Restart button restarts the lesson. The Help button can be accessed at any time to search for various help topics. You also have the option of selecting the Sound No Sound, Annotate, and Rotate buttons as previously demonstrated. This has been a short tutorial about the corner menu items in Snowflake MultiTeach.